Yo guys, what is happening with Mario Double Games and welcome to another episode of the City Skyline series. Today we are back in our world here. Check it out. We've got quite a little bit going on today. If you guys remember last episode, we were working on the highway build here and it's been coming along pretty nicely. You guys can see, okay, maybe that was a little bit of an exaggeration. We got a couple sharp lines we might want to work on in the future and definitely a couple things that, that could have been done better. But for the most part, it's done. It's working, functional. I'm very happy with how it turned out and uh, there's already some people using it like this guy right here. What's your deal, buddy? Uh, it's a box truck. Box truck, okay. Um, owner is ready to wear LTD, and I guess they, they move ready to wear stuff. Cool. Um, yeah, so that's that. Little Tweety Bird up here. What's going on? Oh, nothing. Is there anything I should be concerned about? Um, police officers, small hashtag storage spaces with secure doors for rent. Call 911 for more information. Interesting. Um, okay, first thing I can see is there's a little bit of a disconnect over here. And yes, it does seem to be an issue. Power. Let's get that solved. Um, can we just draw a little line over here? Or what, what's the deal here? What do we have to do? Um, does it matter? Do we need that power to go to the main town? Possibly. Probably not, though, right? I don't know. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's any room under there for a power line. What if I just go ahead here and, and maybe rip some of this out and then retry here at, at building this across? Um, maybe like that. And then we can maybe run a full line just over here. Uh, come on. Let's go um, right to there. No, is there no chance we're even going to get across that bridge, I guess? Hmm, yeah, it looks like it might just be too low to even get across, which is unfortunate. And we can't go under. Nope. Okay. Now, I have experienced this thing before, and I believe the last time that I, I solved it was with um, underground uh, power, which I don't see uh, here as an option. All right, you know what, guys? It doesn't actually look like this is in use right now, and it is kind of in the way of the roads here anyway. So I think it's going to be best if we just get rid of it uh, by bulldozing it here. And then if we need more power, we can go ahead across the river here and add some power uh, supplies. There we go. A little bit of an eyesore out of the way there as well. Can we get rid of this one? Come on. There we go. That's going to make our river look a lot better. Obviously, we have a couple uh, little issues here with all the water and whatnot. These uh, buildings are going up, though, in density as well, which is nice. Um, garbage is still an issue. I wonder if that's because uh, because we don't have enough. Oh, our processing status is still down for some reason. Even though we have so many incineration plants, check this out. We should not need this many. I think that's just because they can't get around fast enough and that eventually they'll solve that issue. So hopefully that's the case. Might be a smart idea to look into just doing a separate garbage area where they can get right off the highway into the sections of the city that they need to get to. Possibly going to look into that. Also, it looks like a good place for an off, uh, off and on ramp will be right here going into this road. So I might look into that as well because that would help with a lot of the traffic issues as well. In fact, why don't we look into doing that right now? So what we're going to do is right off this corner here, we're going to go with a nice little off ramp onto there. Is there no way that we can get further out? Oh, wait, there was a good one there. Yeah, why don't we do something like that? Hopefully that'll help free up traffic a little bit. People from over here can get onto the highway that way. Now, another thing that we could, what we would like to have, I think, would be to have this come around and maybe go up a little bit. How do I do that again? Use the arrows. Um, too deep. Okay, what if we did something like that and then came around like so? No, are we not going to be able to do this? Oh, it looks like we are going to be able to do this, guys. So if we just do something like that, aha, uh -huh, now they can get both ways out of there. Now, if we want an exit in here, that's probably not a bad idea either. So we'll come in just like so. I know this isn't the most beautiful thing ever, but uh, but that's going to do. And then if people are coming off this way and they want to get out, that's the only thing that they can't do right now. I guess we should come up with a solution for that as well. Can we get up here at all? Maybe, possibly, just before then. Yep, okay. And let's get all the way over here with this. Can we do that? Right there, we can do that. I wonder if that's going to give us enough room. Probably not. So let's see if we can just stick. Oh, yeah, there we go. Actually, that's going to work just great. And then we'll come down maybe onto this road over here somehow. I don't know how we'd go about doing that. But, yeah, I mean, that would be ideal. That's already occupied, though, obviously. So if we just did a little curve over here, and then we just came down like that. Can we join up to that? Beautiful. All right. So, I mean, we got rid of a little bit of industry, but that's going to help with that a lot. So there we go. I'm really just trying to get cars moving in this area because you can see that our off-ramp is still brutal. So at least people can come down here, get off right here, and then enter the uh, the city that way. So that's good. That off-ramp's clogged up. This off-ramp is still a little bit clogged up. We've got another off-ramp right here, which is kind of crazy, which also gets from the, you know, the far area over there. So I'm happy with how that's looking right now. And there's a couple different strategies on how people can get off and on. Um, which is good. Um, the other option for downtown is people can travel all the way around here. It doesn't really make as much sense, technically, because they could just go over here. Oh, this is an issue. Right, right. The only reason that cable was there was to power downtown. <laughs> That's right. Um, okay, so what we need to do is, is simply replace that cable. I totally forgot about that. I don't know why I thought. I thought those things were powering down here, but obviously that wasn't the case. And, and we needed the power from downtown or from this side of the city. 
let's get that power cable reran and get that problem solved for all these poor people. Um, there we go. They're going to be all, all feeling good now after that. Um, okay, so what do we want to do? We want to start working on this area over here, I think, and that could be a lot of fun. Um, okay, shall we do that? I think we should do that. So I want to run a, a, a road going maybe just over this this thing here. This is kind of going to be a strange street, but, uh, but nevertheless, we're going to do it. It's going to go, oh man, it's not going to be high enough, will it? Because I wanted to do that. Um, wait a second, I saw some blue there. That's going to be possible, but it's going to be really weird. Ah, you know, it'll look okay. So, what am I doing this for? I know it's kind of crazy looking, but this is what this is what I was hoping to do. Do oh my gosh, architectural masterpiece. Oh my gosh, I just got to use this as a thumbnail because you guys are gonna love this. <laughs> It'd be fine if there's another highway going into the other one, but there's just not, and it just looks awful. Okay, most things I don't care about, but that one's got to go. That was bad. Um, so let's try starting down here. Maybe uh, the goal though is to have a, another ring road going around the outside here and and hooking that up. Um, you know, via via the highway and whatnot, just like the other one, um, just kind of better. Okay, we don't want that. Yes, yes, no, no, more of more of the non-bridge action. Yep, no, come on. Yeah, there we go. No, no, I'm working on it here, but I can't seem to get it. Uh oh, there we go. I had it there for a second. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, oh, I placed the wrong thing. Let's see if we can build it off of here. Come on. Oh wait, can we just do that? Does that work? Can can cars get under there? Oh, I didn't know that you didn't have to go that high. I thought you had to go two up. I guess cars can still, can still get under there. Looks great then. Perfect. Um, so what we're gonna do now? We're gonna go down. Uh, yep, back onto the back on a road height or whatever. And just like that, we're gonna be going along the road here and trying to come up with some nice little building plots that people can that can work on. So this road's gonna go all the way around here probably, and I don't know how we're gonna go about doing that yet. Yeah, yeah bulldoze that big rock, and uh, we'll just go to there for right now, and we'll probably continue that down down the coast and whatnot. Um, but for this one, let's come out a little ways here. I kind of want to hang it over the water. Does that make sense there? Well, it's already done, so there you go. Yeah, it looks all right. And it will have those little rocks there and, and whatever that is for uh, just for fun. Oh, the flooding there. That could be an issue, but hopefully that will solve itself. Um, and then we'll come all the way over here, just like so. And then we have to do a little bit of bending going on here. Okay, not like that, though. Oh, man. Aha! It's actually a lot easier to play from up here. Maybe not this far up, but that works pretty well. And then uh, can we connect this down here, just like so? And I kind of want to draw it under here. I don't know if that's going to be possible or what. Can we get it under there at all? No. Oh yeah, we can. Never mind. There we go. So we do. We do have the road continuing down under here. And uh, this episode is going to be a lot more road building. I mean, we do a lot of road building in this game. It is a city building game. So there you go. That's actually mainly what we do. And <laughs> we just build roads and zone things. That's kind of a cool road though, going along the outside there. And uh, we'll just start zoning up the inside here. I think the first thing that we want is an uptown area of the downtown. And we're going to do that in this little section right here, kind of around the highway. And then we'll build it down to some residential and commercial. So how are we going to go about doing that? That's a great question. We're just going to go here with some single laners. I don't want it to get too congested, actually. So why don't we go ahead here and just build some, some basic on and off ramps, just uh, getting this going here. Um, okay, so we're going to go from here down to here. Nice and simple. We also want a way off of here up to here. So that's a couple things that we should get going here. Um, can we build it over the water? Is that possible? I'm sure it is, right? Yeah, there we go. Beautiful. Again, pretty simple. We're going to go from here up to here. Nice. And then we're going to go from there down onto the road. If we could only reach there, that would be amazing. Um, let me try it again. Slope too steep. Well, it's already occupied. Why don't we head to or here? Wait, can we if we bend this out more like there and then we come in? Can we do it then? Aha. Yes, we can. Okay, so that looks good right about there. Now that is a good looking on and off ramp, quite honestly. So I'm very happy with that. And there you go. Um, okay, so that's going to help people get on and off there. And, uh, and now we can go ahead here and just start working on a couple different little streets here. First thing that I'm thinking of is putting a four laner right down the middle. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. Actually, no, it's not a good idea. I'm not going to do it. Um, what we're going to do is just some little single laners. And it's going to be like a really nice area. We're going to make it out of trees and, uh, and curved roads. And it's going to be all very nice little residential buildings. So all very much curved like this is going to be like a big park, basically. I have no idea yet, but yeah, we're going to figure it out. It's going to be kind of a waste of space, to be honest. But um, but you know what? Whatever. It's going to be a really nice area to live, and uh, that'll be that. Yeah, so we'll go like this here, and then maybe something like that, and then a little something like that. All right, beautiful. Then this one's going to come along like so and kind of use maximize all this space in there. And then we're going to build off of that road just by doing little little curves and stuff. That'll, that'll be good there. And then maybe off this little one here, we'll come around like so. And just build all of this out. 
Unfortunately, it's not the best place for a little community like this because the highway is so close and it makes it really awkward. But you know what? We're just going to do it anyway. It doesn't make sense, though, because the land value will technically be lower because of the big highway. Um, but you know what? It's okay. It's okay. We're going to have to just figure things out. That can go over to there. Hopefully help with the traffic a little bit. In fact, we might just do houses all in here. Might look better. Although I do want some some large density or whatever it's called over here. High density. <laughs> So why don't we go ahead here and do a couple high density builds all up to maybe the end of this street here and all the way maybe up to here. So just like that. I know it doesn't really make sense to have all these high density buildings here, but I think it's just going to be better. And we can do obviously these areas can be high density on the road here. Yeah, I think it's just going to be a nice little kind of outdoor area with some big, big towers and whatnot. Then the rest of all this over here, guys, is going to be using low density residential, which for some reason I can't quite zone, but it's gonna look something like that. And we're just gonna go ahead here and just go with it and see what happens. Um, so there we go. That looks good. And we'll fill in a couple of these as well. And that's gonna be really nice. It's gonna be all little houses on the water. And, uh, and overall, I think we'll end up looking really cool. Then we're gonna swap over to high density over here and, uh, and fill all that in. Hopefully we can make that little transition over here as well. That won't be too harsh. There we go. That looks good. Um, and then we'll put the high density all through here. Oh, oh, this looks good. Oh, I didn't pipe any of this stuff. All right, so all this needs to be piped, of course. Uh, something that I didn't think of. And then also, they need, they're going to need some power over here. I think this will be a really nice little neighborhood, though. I'm very excited about it. Um, can we pipe off of one of these? Thank you. Nope. Yeah, there we go, guys. We got some nice little pipes going in here. And then one right up the middle. No? Can we do that? No? Okay, here. Let's try it from over here. There we go, the pipes are all in place. We need a little bit of hydro over here, of course. So I'm gonna just run a little hydro line from here all the way to maybe right here. That should get our, our hydro solved and then that will connect in no time. All right guys, and for right now, that is going to do it for today's episode. We will check out this new little community that we're building uh, a little bit later, but I am very excited about how it's turned out here. We've already got a nice little building going up and uh, we'll put lots of parks in and stuff too to raise the land value. So very excited about that, it looks good. And um, we'll see how that turns out. Anyway, that is going to end today's episode. Unfortunately, that's all the time that we do have. If you guys did enjoy it, please don't forget to go below. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video.